My name is Marcus, and I am uh, going to be showing a overclocked Pixie kernel. As you can see, it's uh, currently unlocked already. Go ahead and bring up Governor and show you the uh, what it's currently running at. Governor is launching. You see, it launched pretty quick. Uh, it's blurry, and I apologize best I can do right now but you can see it's running at uh, well it was running there it goes back up to 748.8 megahertz and that is with the overclock kernel and then it seems to kind of drop to uh, 122 when it's not being actively used um, if the screen kind of tries to dim it looks like it drops down to 120 uh, 122.8 just tapping it brings it back up to 7, 748.8 you saw how quick the Governor um, app launched out of card view. Bring up a web browser. And you saw how quick that, that loaded up. This is my wife's pre. She's left pretty much everything stock. And see, um, I have an airwave in the house because I have horrible reception. And just look, it dropped the airwave and went back to the uh, Evdo. So there's the palm site and bring back up governor. See it's launching pretty quickly as well. And it's running at 748 megahertz. Now uh, I want to launch Angry Birds and show you how quickly it launches. Reveal icon and bam, there we go. Loading already. Angry Birds usually takes a few seconds to load period anyway. There you go, this is the light version. My wifey hasn't sprung for the full. Turn down the volume so you can actually hear me. Go ahead and hit play. Load up one of the levels. And you can see it runs pretty smooth. Go ahead and launch my birdie here. Uh, fail. Hmm, <laughs> didn't kill anything. But there's that. See, it throws things away very quickly, even quicker than normal stock. Still running at 748.8 megahertz. It dropped down to 480 just now. This is an experimental kernel. It's actually an AT&T kernel on a Sprint Pre, or a Pixie, imagine that. And then it dropped down to 122 again. Back up to 748.8. It's a little bit unstable. Uh, running at 39 degrees and uh, drawing anywhere from 100 to 140 milliamps. Pretty awesome stuff. Hopefully soon this will be a more stable kernel, possibly overclocked even more. Who knows? This is Marcus running an overclocked Pixie kernel on a Sprint Pixie.